The feminist art movement refers to the efforts and accomplishments of feminists internationally to produce art that reflects women's lives and experiences, as well as to change the foundation for the production and reception of contemporary art. It also sought to bring more visibility to women within art history and art practice. Corresponding with general developments within feminism, and often including such self-organizing tactics as the consciousness-raising group, the movement began in the 1960s and flourished throughout the 1970s as an outgrowth of the so-called second wave of feminism. It has been called, "...the most influential international movement of any during the post-war period". History The 1960s was period of civil rights and gay and lesbian rights movements and protests against war. It was also a period when women artists wanted to gain equal rights as men within the established art world, influenced by modernist movements, utopian ideals, and to create feminist art, often in non-traditional ways, to help change the world. Louise Bourgeois 1911 to 2010 and German-American Eva Hess 1936 to 1970 explore some of the themes in feminist art like domestic life, personal experience and the women's body. On the 20th of July 1964, Yoko Ono, an avant-garde artist, singer and activist, presented cut piece at the Yamaichi Concert Hall, Kyoto, Japan, where she sat still as parts of her clothing were cut off of her, which meant to protest violence against women. She performed it again at Carnegie Hall in 1965. Her son, Sean, participated in the artist performance on 15 September 2013 at the Théâtre La Ranelagh in Paris. The Guardian's Jonathan Jones considered it, "...one of the ten most shocking performance artworks ever." Women artists, motivated by feminist theory and the feminist movement, began the feminist art movement in the 1970s. Feminist art represented a shift away from modernism, where art made by women was put in a different class to works made by men. The movement cultivated a new feminist consciousness, a freedom to respond to life unimpeded by traditional male mainstream, or, as Griselda Pollock and Razika Parker put it, a separation of art with a capital A from art made by women produced a feminine stereotype. This demand for equality in representation was codified in the Art Workers Coalition's AWC Statement of Demands, which was developed in 1969 and published in definitive form in March 1970. The AWC was set up to defend the rights of artists and force museums and galleries to reform their practices. While the coalition sprung up as a protest movement following Greek kinetic sculptor Panagiotis, Takis. Vasilakis's physical removal of his work Tele Sculpture from a 1969 exhibition at the Museum of Modern Art, New York, it quickly issued a broad list of demands to art museums in general, alongside calls for free admission, better representation of ethnic minorities, late openings, and an agreement that galleries would not exhibit an artwork without the artist's consent. The AWC also demanded that museums encourage female artists to overcome centuries of damage done to the image of the female as an artist by establishing equal representation of the sexes in exhibitions, museum purchases and on selection committees, there are also feminist forms of postmodernism which emerged in the 1980s. The feminist art movement grew out of the struggle to find a new way to express sexual, material, social and political aspects of life, and femininity. Feminist art movements emerged in the United States, Europe, including Spain, Australia, Canada, and Latin America in the 1970s. Since then, there are women's art movements in Sweden, Denmark and Norway, Russia, and Japan. Women artists from Asia, Africa and particularly Eastern Europe emerged in large numbers onto the international art scene in the late 1980s and 1990s as contemporary art became popular worldwide. Major exhibitions of contemporary women artists include WAC. Art and the Feminist Revolution curated by Connie Butler, SF MoMA, 2007, Global Feminisms curated by Linda Nochlin and Maura Riley at the Brooklyn Museum, 2007, Rebel, curated by Miriam Weston at MMKA, Arnheim, 2009, Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. 45 Years of Art and Feminism curated by Xavier Arakistan at Bilbao Fine Arts Museum, 2007, Els at Centre Pompidou in Paris 2009 which also toured to Seattle Art Museum, have been increasingly international in their selection. This shift is also reflected in journals set up in the 1990s like N.Paradoxa. 
Topic: Artists, 20th 21st century. Marina Abramovic, Eija Liza Attila, Gada Amer, Laurie Anderson, Janine Antony, Vanessa Beecroft, Cosima von Bonin, Louise Bourgeois, Angela Bullock, Sophie Kaye, Judy Chicago, Leisha Clark, Hannah Darboven, Sonia Delany, Marlene Dumas Tracy Emin Valley Export Sylvie Fleury Katerina Fritsch Ellen Gallagher Issa Jenskin Nan Golden Natalia Goncharova Renee Green Asta Grotting Guerrilla Girls Mona Hatoum Barbara Hepworth Lynn Hirschman Eva Hess Hannah Hope Candida Hofer Topic See also Topic References Topic Further reading Juan Vicente Aliaga Gender Battle A Batalla dos Zeneros Spain Santiago de Compostela 2007 Juan Aliaga and Maria Laura Rosa Recuperar la Memoria, Experiencias Feministas Deste el Arte, Argentina y España, Ana Navarret and Mujeres Publicas Centro Cultural de España, Buenos Aires and CCEBE, Seed Piranha, 2013. L. Anderson, A. Livian Ingerson, M. Jensner, A. Nystrom, B. Workmeister, N. Osland, eds. Constfeminism Helsingborg, Sweden, Dunkers Kulturhaus and Lylvalch Konsthal, 2004. Kathy Batista Re Negotiating the Body, Feminist Art in 1970s London, I. B. Tories, 2011. Carla Bianpoen, Farah Wardani, Wulandurgan Toro Indonesian Women Artists Jakarta, Yayazan Semirapa Indonesia, 2007. Katie Deepwell ed. New Feminist Art Criticism, Critical Strategies UK, Manchester, Manchester University Press, 1995. Sylvia Eibelmer die Frau als Bild, der Weibliche Korper in der Kunst des 20 Jahrhunderts Berlin, Dietrich Reimer, 1993. Isabel Gra die Besser Haft, Künstlerinnen des 20. und 21. Jahrhunderts Cologne, du Mont Verlag, 2003. Karen Heinzbo The Beginning is Always Today, Scandinavian Feminist Art from the Last 20 Years Norway, Sarlandes Kunstmuseum, 2013. Johanna Householder and Tanya Mars EDS Caught in the Act, an anthology of performance art by Canadian women Toronto, YYZ Books, 2003. Lucy Lippard from the Centre, Feminist Essays on Women's Art New York. Dutton, 1976. Razika Parker and Griselda Pollock Framing Feminism, Art and the Women's Movement, 1970–1985 London. Pandora, RKP, 1987. Boyana Pejic ed. The Gender Check Reader Vienna, MUMOK and Erste Foundation, 2010 Griselda Pollock ed. Generations and Geographies London, Routledge, 1996. Helena Reckett ed. Art and Feminism London, Faden, 2001 Hilary Robinson ed. Visibly Female London, Camden Press, 1987 Hilary Robinson ed. Feminism, Art Theory, an Anthology, 1968–2000 Oxford. Blackwells, 2001. Araceli Barbosa Sanchez Arte Feminista en Los Achenta en Mexico, Una Perspectiva de Genero Mexico, Casa Juan Pablo Centro Cultural, Universidad Autónoma de Estado de Morelos, 2008. Ella Shohat ed. Talking Visions, Multicultural Feminism in a Transnational Age Cambridge, Massachusetts, MIT, 1998 Bridget Tracy Tan Women Artists in Singapore Singapore, Select Books and Singapore Art Museum, 2011. Jane Wark Radical Gestures, Feminism and Performance Art in North America Montreal, McGill Queen's University Press, 2006. Women Down the Pub aka. N. Dubois Boule, L. Strombeck, A. Sanjus Daughter, Udsight, Feministiske Strategi or I. Dansk Bildkunst, View, Feminist Strategies in Danish Visual Art, Denmark, Informations Vorla, 2004.